Hello Year 12 Statistics students, this is Bryn here, giving you everything you need to know ready for the exam in January, all the things you need to be doing so that you can revise and be ready. The first place we're going to start, the notes booklet. This is our textbook for the whole course. You need to make sure that it's filled in. We've told you this before, we'll tell you it again and again and again. If there are gaps, if you have missed a lesson, it's your responsibility to go and fill those gaps in. Okay, everything you need is on the Google site and on the YouTube channel. So there should be no excuses for this. The contents page is there and there's even the checklist on the uh, Google sheet for you to check. If we look here at the Google site for statistics, okay, go to lesson resources. First topic did was averages. For every lesson, for every topic, there is a video which is the run through of those notes, those examples and the answers to now you try. There's the questions. You probably use this question sheet in class. There's solutions there as well to go with it. Really important that if you've missed a lesson, you find that topic, use the contents page, okay? Find the correct video to match with it, and then fill in those notes. You will not be able to revise for this subject unless you have those notes filled in. Next, the homework, okay? You should have used the orange book should have completed sections one to four. That is measures of location and spread and the three different normal distribution ones. In the pink homework booklet, you should have completed the first two pages, first two sections, bivariate data and regression. This should already be done. You should have either marked them in class or been sent the answers by your teacher. So you should know what you're getting right and wrong on those already. All of this should already have been done as the minimum standard for what we expect on the course. Okay. So what can you do next? Well, you've got the revision cards. We've made some of those in class as well. And again, on this Google site, you have all those question sheets. If you wanted to check about PMCC, SRCC, you can go back. You can find a worksheet, okay? PMCC hypothesis testing, I want to practice that. That's something that I'm not so sure about. I'm going to go to it, open it up. I'm going to do these questions again in my book. Okay. I'm going to check, I know how to use my calculator. I'm going to make sure I'm reading all of the words carefully, okay? And then once I've done that, I can go back to the Google site, click on the solutions and see if I've set my work out the same way. These are things that all students should be doing, particularly after a few weeks after a topic, going back and look at it, at it again. You've received for your tutor groups, from your progress tutor, about the effective studying checklist. Thinking about condensing your notes. Okay, going back over topics more than once. Now we do some of this in class already. We put old topics up as starters. We go back to previous topics. You need to do it as well. Exam questions. Well. There's some of those on the exam homework that I'm going to come on to in a minute. Okay. All these different things, the command words, the key words, you need to be thinking about which of these are best for you and having a go. Online quizzes, each of those Google sites pages, okay, PMCC and SRCC, has a quiz at the bottom. One for linear regression there, one for PMCC and SRCC. Those are automatically marked 
So you can check those as well. All right. These are the things that you need to be doing as independent, proactive A-level students. Final thing, and again, this is we set as homework. It should be printed out and you should have, hand, have it handed out during lessons. The topics that we're doing. Okay, There's a question for each one. So if you're confident with these, you'll be confident with the mock in January. Each of these questions has a topic. Okay. So you know what you need to be doing. Use your notes booklet, open it up, use it to help you while you're doing this. If you're feeling confident, go straight for it without any notes. Try and do it in time conditions. Okay. It's about two minutes per mark, maybe one and a half minutes per mark in statistics. So topics for this one, PMCC, regression, SRCC, averages, binomial distribution, the frequency of box plots, sampling methods, normal distribution, errors, chi-squared. These are the topics that you should have done with your teachers in class. And so you should be ready and confident to practice all these, do this homework, and then we will be giving you the answers to these for you to mark them yourselves. Really important, you will have the solutions to check. So when you're completing this homework over the holidays, do it. Use your notes booklet if you need help. But finally, mark it from the solutions and make sure that you know what you're getting right and what you're getting wrong and what you need to practice more. Hope that helps. Any questions, please email bfh.osfc.ac.uk. All the best.